Sula National Matters, the chairman of the All Progressive Congress Ward 10 in Edo State, Oshawa Stephen, has threatened to send the national chairman of the party, Adams Oshomole, to jail over claims he continues to parade himself as the bona fide member of the party, even after his suspension at the ward level. Stephen, while leading a delegation of other state party executives to the Edo State Governor, Godwin Obaseki, said the state APC, including the party's Ward 10 in Esako, local government area of the state, where the national chairman Adams Oshomole is registered are fully behind the governor for a second term bid. We talked to see our, our chairman of Ward 10. We come to visit our governor for the new year so that we have prayer with him that God should continue to help him elevate him for this good work he's doing in Edo State. Let the water tell you, if there's even tech tell you. We are ready to give to the governor. Since they say he must serve two tendo, we cannot serve three tendo. Let's, let us be done with it, the people, not pursue them. But he said that his authority must, must uh, prevail. We said no. Now we are here to identify with him, to wish him a happy new year. And secondly, to let the whole world know that he voted, that I came from, the national charm has been suspended. It's a suspension. Parading itself as a national chairman is against the law. But I don't know if you put the, the, the penalty. Because if he continues, I believe we head up in jail. So if you love him, I speak on behalf of it, like West Coast government leaders, all the world youth leaders we have met and discussed, are concluded that this is also special. It cannot call any BT, and no of us will obey the BT. Under the circumstances, you would uh, expect that. Um, uh, people at the world level would have been put under extreme pressure by now. So you can understand uh, their situation. But as you can see, these men and women are determined to ensure that justice prevails in APC and Edo State. Meanwhile, the People's Democratic Party in Edo State has assured Edo State residents it will reclaim its mandate during the next governorship elections. Party leaders spoke to newsmen in Bidi City after a closed-door meeting where they strategized on the party's upcoming primaries and the upcoming state elections. They all maintained that the PDP is ready to conduct credible and transparent congresses across the state. The meeting of uh, leaders of Edo State PDP, uh, in fact, you can go ahead and uh, refer to it as a New Year meeting, where once again we have uh, stated our resolve to ensure that we win back Edo State. We, are, we express our disappointment at what is going on in the state. Everybody has aspirations, everybody has a dream. What the party's position to do with the Governance leadership we have in PDP is to work hard to win the governorship election in the state. Being a political party is good, but being in government is what is important. That's the essence of politics. If the leadership thinks that's what they want to do, it doesn't stop my aspiration. There are a lot of good candidates in PDP that are aspiring to be government. But at the end of the day, the people of the party, the leadership, and the people in the state determine who rules them. Obviously, you know that over the years, PDP has one family. Even when there's little misunderstanding, we always settle behind closed doors. Um, I don't think anything will be different just now. Um, if there are crises in our political parties, obviously not in PDP.